Our first guest is the woman behind The Push, one of the Washington Post's top recommendations, calling it this year's first blockbuster novel. Ashley Audrain's debut thriller has taken the literary world by storm. It is a tense psychological drama about a mother whose marriage unravels and sanity is questioned when she begins to suspect her own young daughter is a sociopath. Sounds right. Really? Look, I mean, I got goosebumps already. <laughs> Ashley Aldrain joins us from her home in Toronto, Canada. Ashley, thank you so much. Congratulations on all of this. I, what, what you posted on social media at some point in time that just, you could not believe it yourself that this was all happening. Oh, thank you for having me. No, I, I'm still pinching myself many times a day, Tamron. I really am about the fact that this book is in the world, that it's been published, um, and just the reception that I've been getting from readers has been so touching. It's been so fast, beautiful. too. We're talking about a little over a month. Instant hit New York Times bestsellers list. Um, and you posted on that Instagram, mine officially blown. So this book <laughs> is mind blowing. It is uncomfortable. It is provocative. As a mom, it takes us into dark spaces and places that are chilling. Was that intimidating for you to take on the subject matter? I'm not going to give too much away because we're, you know, we want you to buy the book, but <laughs> it does uh, hit a nerve for sure. Yeah, you know, I, when I became a mom myself, which was about six years ago now, you know, I really thought a lot in that first year, especially with my son, um, you know, about the expectations of motherhood, you know, how we are taught motherhood should feel, how we're taught it's going to be, what it, well, you know, what it should look like, even the way we are meant to speak about motherhood. You know, it doesn't always feel that way and it doesn't always end up that way. Um, you know, and oftentimes, you know, we can sense a lot of darkness in motherhood and and, you know, there, I think that there naturally sort of is a lot of fear and darkness um, in the experience of motherhood for some women. Um, and yet we are not often really invited to talk about that or explore that. And so as a writer, you know, I wanted to use fiction as the place to explore that, you know, to a place to explore one woman's journey, Blythe, the main character in the book, you know, when it turns out that motherhood, you know, is not at all what she'd hoped for. And in fact, it is everything that she'd feared. And to your point, it's not just not only what she'd hoped for, she has zero connection to her new child. And all of this is from her perspective of what she is feeling about this child she's supposed to instantly love. Here's a clip from the audiobook. The only mother who looked down at her daughter and thought, please go away. Violet cried only when she was with me. It felt like a betrayal. We were supposed to want each other. What was the inspiration for this character? Well, I think, you know, because I was sort of going through, um, you know, those early stages of motherhood when I first began writing this book, you know, I sat down to write the first scenes of The Push when my own son was six months old, you know, and he had had some health problems when he was born. And so, you know, I, I was sort of figuring out how to be a mother in that first year, but also within the context of, you know, how to, how to, how to mother a, a, a child who had an illness, you know, at the children's mm -hmm. hospital a lot. Um, and that experience was very challenging as it is for, you know, many parents who are in that boat. But, but, you know, yeah, I really, I think that I just, I really noticed about how little was discussed about those harder parts of it, yeah. um, you know, and, and what that can really be like for women. Yeah. Um, as I, you know, we, we really aren't often invited to kind of talk about that without a sort of sense of shame or judgment right. around it. Well, you referenced that fear and motherhood have this mm -hmm. huge connection. Well, the book is brilliant. Congratulations. I mean, you know, it takes a special author to be able to take us into dark spaces and places, mm -hmm. and we want to dwell and understand it, and that's what you've done with this. So congratulations. Thank you so much. Thank Absolutely. You, and Ashley's book, of course, is called The Push. It is available now 